Students in Orange County just wrapped up their third day of virtual learning, but the district is still preparing to open for face-to-face -face learning next week. Schools are preparing for students by following guidance from the district's new medical advisory committee. The committee is scheduled to meet tonight. New 6's Nadine Yanis talked with a doctor on that committee today. So Nadine, what exactly is the role of this medical advisory committee? Well, its original intention was to guide the school district on how to reopen schools safely. As of last week, they weren't allowed to talk about whether or not they thought it was safe to reopen schools at all. However, after a late vote here at the school board last night, now these doctors can weigh in if they think schools should reopen at all. And we got the opinion from one doctor on that board. All right, let's go through the roll call. This was the first time the Orange County Public Schools Medical Advisory Committee met last week. The group of 11 medical professionals, including doctors, nurses, and hospital leaders, given the task to guide the district on reopening schools. It's a very complex um, problem that we're facing, but one that we have to face nonetheless. Winter Park pulmonologist Dr. Akin Ajay is on that committee. I am a pediatric lung and sleep disorder specialist. Who has treated pediatric patients with COVID-19 ready to express his opinions, especially after a late vote by the Orange County School Board that gave the committee the ability to advise on whether or not schools are safe to reopen at all. It was outside of our scope to um, discuss or make or, or provide advice regarding reopening. I think as of last night, that has changed. I think anytime we put restrictions on any um, medical professional, um, we unnecessarily tie their hands. So as a pulmonologist who specializes in lung diseases in children, where is your stance on physically reopening classrooms? Nowhere else in a civilized world would anyone consider reopening schools right at the height of a pandemic? Um, so that's my thought is that nowhere else in the world would you do this this way. It makes absolutely um, no sense. It makes no sense. That is the advice from one doctor on the medical advisory committee. They were sending to meet at seven o'clock tonight. The school board Though when they made this vote were clear that though the advisory committee might recommend something, it'll still be up to them on whether or not schools reopen. And as of right now, face to face learning begins on Monday here in Orange County. We will hear more from that doctor and his opinions coming up at five. Back to you. And of course, the threat of losing funding hanging over all of this. Nadine Giannis, thank you.